guys, Danny from Inglorious Fishing. We're going out digging bait today. We're on a fishing expedition with Smash Fishing. Hell yeah. Anyway, we're off to go and dig the ragworm, baby. The sun's in my eyes, so I probably look like Ching Chong China Man. <laughs> Stay tuned, and we're going to start making our way down to the beach. It's Inglorious and Smash Production. Woo! Guys, we're gonna try here. We're gonna try here. We normally go for green weed, and the green weed is what we see, baby. So hopefully we get some ragworm. Stay tuned. Dig. Hopefully we get some. Certainly, eh? Few nice ones. That's, that's one of uh, oh, the. Some... Oh, thought I seen one more like open. <laughs> <laughs> it's always the same though. You find that that's one little spot. Nice eh? logworm. That's a nice logworm. That. Get bigger though. Looking for the fat juicy back one. Captain Dano's the Worminator. There's one. It's a nice one. Yeah, that's more like it. <laughs> Find a few decent ones here, dude. That one hanging out the water. Look at that. That's a log one. Oh, Hawkeye. Hawkeye. The Worminator is in process. Oh, the Worminator is not getting on there. <laughs> Now the camera's on, we're not getting anything. We were getting some corkers before. Yeah, some big bubbles. Let's try in there, look at some green weed. They love the green weed. Check those ones out. Nice fat worms. Fat wormies. Hey guys, what I've been digging logworm. Jay's been on the hunt for some peeler crabs and I think he's been successful. It's a perfect representation of them as well. Oh look, there you are guys, look. Check that out. That is perfect for a peeler crab right there. Perfect, you know it. Whenever you see a crab on top of another crab, the crab's protecting that one because it's a peeler. As you remove that one, that's a prime example. Look, there we go. Watch take this. the claw off and it should be like an orangey colour. It will come out with the leg. Oh, look, that's absolutely perfect. That is a perfect size peeler crab, that, for a gilt head or a bass. Oh, aye, aye. Loving it, my boy. He Woo! loves the peeler crab. Let's get some more. Oh. Dropping. <laughs> <laughs> it's a 
guys, we've arrived at the destination. We're going to be heading up that path towards a place called the Goof. There's Jay just sorting his bag out. Oh, he's got his camera. Candy cam. Candy camera. We've got a load of uh, ragworm in there and some peelers. We've got some oh my God, some razor fish there. So anyway, stay tuned. We're going to start making our way up there and hopefully we get something. It's in Glorious and Smash Productions. Here we go. Guys, that's our view from the office today. Down there, baby. Jay's over there in front, filming the wildlife. Dragging my stuff behind me. He's dragging his stuff behind him. Look at that, guys. That's where we're heading. Stay tuned. And hopefully, we get you some great fishing action and great fishing content. Look at those down there, the rocks. Beautiful. Hi guys, well we're back at uh, Inglorious and Smash Productions, We've got Jay again with us. Now, uh, as you'll see in the previous bit, we did actually walk down towards the goof. Problem was the wind was hampering us and me and Jay. We decided to take a little chip for a few hours. Yeah, it was a bit blowy, yeah. It was a bit blowy. We were a bit tired from the walk-in. So now we're going to go down there. We're going to target a few bass with the lures. Hopefully we can window a few out. And then we're going to go bottom fishing. Hopefully we can get a gilt head or a basso wasso. So stay tuned. Fingers crossed. It's Inglorious and Smash Productions, baby. Number one channel. There's Jay trying to win the one out. Got the old stand. Got the old stand, baby. Just a few casts, guys. Jay's using what rod are you using there, chap? That's the 10 Regiment 2. And the reel there? 10 Battle 2. 10 Battle 2. You've got a uh, nice, nice bit of uh, equipment there. Yeah, it's got a lot of backbone as well. A lot of backbone to it. Anyway, I'm just using my Sonic SK3 Extra. My spin nine foot rod, it's a 15 to 40 gram weight. It's a great little rod, this. Jay used to have one till he snapped this. Yeah, they're, they're proper bend as well, but they've got <laughs> some backbone. Anyway, let's try and get one, guys. Stay tuned. Guys, enjoying a nice barbecue there. That's a good thing about Guernsey. Absolutely great. What a day. What an evening. Well, guys, look at that for a sunset. We're going to be heading over there. We're going to be getting the bait rods out. Hopefully, get some gilt, some bass as the sun's coming down. This smash, he's already off. He can't wait. Bait fishing, baby. Bait fishing. Anyway, stay tuned. Look at this. It's absolutely wonderful. Can't beat this. Out with friends and fishing, baby. Stay tuned. So, guys, I've currently got my rods out. I've got a 1 0 hook on. They're both on Ron and Ledger's. Got a 1 0 hook on. And then on the other one, I've got a 5 0 hook on one. The 1 0 hook's got ragworm, and the 5 0 hook's got a nice peeler crab on with a head hook ragworm. So, hopefully, get something. I don't know, I might be able to get it, but can you just check that sun? Look at that, guys, absolutely beautiful. This is where we're fishing today. Jay's just got his rod out. We've got the moon in the background there. Hopefully, we get some gilts or something, baby. Stay tuned, it's in glorious. Both the same, eh? All right, yeah, okay. You know I mean? Well, guys, Jay's getting a few nibbles. Let's we'll see if I can get it. A few nibbles there on the end of the rod. Seem to have stopped now. There's definitely a few nibbles. Yeah, he was definitely there. Yeah. Give him a little time to eat. A little time to eat. Anyway, stay tuned. Hopefully, we get something fairly quickly by the looks of it, eh, mate? Hopefully, mate. Yeah, Hopefully. That's a good sign. Here we go. 
Well, guys, just moved the location. That rod's out. My two rods are out. And within 10 minutes, check this out for a fish, baby. Lovely gilthead. Lovely gilthead. I'd say that's the best part of two and a half, three pound. So, yeah, two, two and a half, maybe. Two, two and a half. Anyway, that's a lovely fish. Jay caught that. Look at that. Look, check the gold bar, baby. That's what we came out to get. That's why oh, we yeah. dogged the peel of crab and the ragworm. Absolutely we're out there awesome. and we're still getting bites. So we're going to go out and get some more, eh, Jay? Hopefully, mate. Hopefully. Oh, oh, missed one already. Go, bars. Let's go, baby. Woo! Oh, guys, just had a nice big bite on the gaper clam. Whether it pursues or not, it's another matter. That was a big bite. Anyway, stay tuned. Hopefully not. Getting nice bites though, mate, eh? Yeah, nice bites. I can't believe I've just licked it. Come on. Are we still there? The anticipation. Captain Dano in his prime. I don't know if I strike it or not. Wait for it to go over, mate. Unless he slack lines you. Well guys, that's another episode of Inglorious and Smash Productions. Uh, just tried noodling a big old lobster. Jay found a top knot and another lobster. There we go, a fair bit around. Yeah, fair bit, fair bit. But to top it off, he had a beautiful gilt head bream, about two and a half, three pound, I reckon. So Jay's gonna be cooking that up tomorrow. So that's gonna be his tea. Fresh tea, baby. Fresh tea, he's happy <laughs> with that. Anyway, if you like the channels, like, subscribe. It's Inglorious and Smash Fishing. Hell yeah.